Turning now to our Low Country newsroom, a community there is raising concerns about a Beaufort County development project. WSAV's Joseph Leonard spoke to those neighbors who worry new construction could hurt the environment. He joins us now to explain. All Joy is a tight-knit community in Bluffton, but for the past couple of years, the county has been trying to build up the area around the All Joy Beach, but neighbors tell me they worry it could hurt the environment. Once in a lifetime uh, chance for us to expand that area down there and, and offer um, more. That was Beaufort County District 9 Councilman Mark Lawson back in January 2023 when the county bought the land surrounding the All Joy boat landing. After recently finishing the dock, it's now pushing forward with more. A sidewalk, bike path, and a parking lot. But people who have lived here for decades say paving this area won't work. Putting a concrete parking lot there is just disastrous. All the boat oil, all the car oil, all the residue from that is just going to go straight down the ramp into the river. I mean, you go to the oyster factory in town and their parking lot is, is simply gravel. The May River is something people like Jim Lawton and Bob Williams take pride in, and protecting it is what they're concerned about. The pair are part of the group Preserve and Protect All Joy, who's been following the development closely for years. Any heavy storm, this whole area down here would be underwater. Where it all goes is in that river. I mean, it's the, the central aspect of the town, slowing down growth and making thoughtful decisions on the town county and state level for all the coastal counties is is critical at this point in time. And while they aren't opposed to the project as a whole, they argue the county is pushing ahead too fast instead of coming up with long term solutions. But in the past, the county has pushed back, saying it's not worried the project will bring more flooding. They'll pretend like they're taking that input in and want to do something. And then six or seven months later, just like the pathway pops up, we're going to do it. But Bob and Jim tell me they're not going to stop advocating for their neighborhood. I also reached out to Councilman Lawson, who represents the Alljoy area, but could not get a hold of him. Joseph Leonard, WSAV News 3, on your side.